So I'm here with Boo Boo Stewart from um, the Twilight series. Now, you actually started in 2010 with Eclipse, right? That was uh, their yes. first debut on there. Um, so how has your involvement with the Twilight series changed your life as an actor? I mean, what, as far as your career has changed? Um, well, in one way, it's gotten busier, you know, with all the traveling. But then in another way, it's gotten a lot easier because you're not, like, always rushing to, like, all the auditions and everything, you know. So, I don't know. It's gotten busier and easier at the same time. It's, uh, it's just fun, though. It really is cool. So, I mean, I know that you're, you're quite the athlete and you have lots of accomplishments, but physically, what was the most demanding thing of Breaking Dawn Part 1 and 2? Physically, I'm just enduring, like, the cold weather. Yeah. I learned, like, one trick was you just have to, like, tense up, like, really tight and just hold it. And then right before you go, you just let go, and you won't uh, chatter your teeth. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> um, I think that was the worst. It's like, they're like, you can't chatter your teeth. Yeah. <laughs> um, so, is there something both positive and negative that you've learned from your involvement with the Twilight series? Um, you know, positive things, I've actually, uh, I've been able to get involved with a lot of charities. Like Child Help is a really amazing charity where they help children that have previously been abused get back on the feed. So it's really cool to be able to help people. Also, there's a mission, uh, it's called Los Angeles Mission, where I, we go up, my family actually. And I've had some friends come with me feed the homeless on certain days. And so we've been able to do a lot of positive things that way. And um, They're ready to do that like on everything. Is it Thanksgiving? Yeah, exactly. you guys uh, Thanksgiving, Christmas, uh, Easter, I think of the, the, the yeah, awesome. celebrations. Very cool. Um, so is there anything negative that you can talk about that maybe like, not negative towards the movie, yeah, yeah. but just... Um, negative things? I don't know. Um, I don't get to watch as much, I don't get to play as much video games as I used to. Yeah. So I guess that'd be the negative thing. <laughs> of all things. I can't bring my Xbox with me everywhere. <laughs> <Right>. so. <laughs> um, so, so for people like the rest of the world who haven't seen Breaking Dawn Part 2, and I'm guessing you've already seen it at least... I've seen it once, yes. Okay. So, what's the most exciting thing, in your opinion, that the fans, or me, or critics, or anybody should be looking forward to? What's, what do you think is the big exciting thing of this, of this last film? I think the most exciting thing is going to be the special features on the DVD. Okay. Out on the 11th. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> um, <laughs> they're awesome. Check it out. Um, so, last question. In 10 years, what do you want critics and people to say about your career as an actor? That's a good question. As an actor, let's see. Just like, I'd like them to think like that I've tried to play all these different characters and not just try and play the same like character in every single movie I, I do. And I don't know, just picking the really heartfelt movies too and just switching them up. You know? I think that's a cool thing. Well, thank you very much. For Texas Art and Film, I'm Dustin Chase.